Hey everybody, I'm David Baldwin. I'm one of the original Idea Sicklers from way back and now using Idea Sickle X as well. Um, I've used the platform many, many times on many different kinds of assignments. And what's great about it is it pulls together disparate points of view, uh, not just what would be considered creatively, just creative people, but letting people be creative, which I think is one of the strengths of it. Um, what I would say is um, the, the best way to use it, if uh, you wanna be the most effective with it is, um, you're, is to realize that you're in building mode um, when you're using this platform. It is not up to you to edit. Um, someone else will edit the, the ideas later and actually come back and maybe even have another round where you can refine things. But what you really wanna do is live in a world of collaboration and yes and. So when somebody puts down an idea, it may be a really stupid idea, um, and then you respond and build build on it. And what you'll find is that the the ideas that make sense get built on and the ones that don't don't but uh you know i've seen really really dumb or really small or really kind of seemingly silly little kernels turn into really big ideas that that end up being the 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 idea that gets chosen or that you want to work on um the other thing is um so so that's how you're you're building on other people's ideas as far as your ideas go um don't be afraid just put stuff down like no it's 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 oddly a, a platform without judgment um what i love about it is you just put stuff down um and you you um you, you go from there so your dumb idea may turn into somebody else's brilliant idea or actually be built upon so you're always in building mode and you're always um you're always taking whatever's there and and trying to see what you can do with it and again the good ideas come forth and if they're not great, no big deal. You just move on. You just keep putting on. So the best thing is just to like hit it, hit it uh, hard and often. But to that point, one of the great things is you can kind of do it in the margins of your day as well. I mean, it does take some concentration, but um, you kind of when you have time, you do about it. You go take a walk. You think of something. You write it down. You come back and you put it on. Or if you're on your mobile, you just use the platform on your mobile. Jot it down. Come back later. Someone else will have built on it. You'd be surprised at sort of the daisy chain of ideas that happen um, when you're using it that way. That's how I use it, um, and it's been really fantastic. I've used it as a as a, a creative person. I've used it as a creative director, and uh, I, my company's used it as well. So it's pretty fantastic. That's how I use it.